Okay, so we're starting off turn number four, and Arjun's going to be heading the charge. Arjun has a speed of five, so we need to get him moved into a position where he can do something useful, hopefully. But I do fear that he's not going to be able to make it to an unexplored edge. Let's find out. One, two, three, four, five. That does not work. One, two, three, four, five. So close. He's going to be one away from being on an unexplored edge, which means he's not going to be able to explore. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, that works. Because you can do that. Uh, I can go one, two, three. I can move through Alyssa, and then I can go corner to corner, and then I can go corner to corner. So one, two, three, four, five. And I think that's what we're going to do because we do need to explore. We need to drill down through those dungeon tiles. Now, it would be helpful to have him move up and take out those rats, but it's not guaranteed that he'll do that. So, yeah, we're going to have Arjun move and explore. So, again, one, two, three, four, five. So, one, two, through Alyssa, which is three, corner to corner, which is four, corner to corner, which is five. So Arjun, uh, no surge, moved, and he will not be attacking, so there's no treasure to be had, but he is going to be able to explore. So that also means that his uh, guided strikes came about and did nothing because this goes away at the end of his hero phase, which is now ended, so this is gone. It sat there and wanted to work but did nothing so that's gone okay let's go ahead and draw a dungeon tile for arjun let me just quickly count how many we've drawn so these are part of the game so we've drawn one two three four five so this will be the sixth tile so we've got a ways to go before we'll be anywhere near the chapel so arjun drew a black tile which means an encounter so we get a black tile and let's see what kind of monster he's going to get. Ah, another gargoyle. Well, that said, I... Let me see, who had the gargoyle before? Alyssa. So yeah, I'm glad I took out the other gargoyle because the way the monsters work, one hero cannot have two of the same named monsters. So like, if since Alyssa had a gargoyle under her activation already. If I had drawn this for Alyssa, I would have just discarded it. But since Alyssa had the gargoyle and I drew this for Arjun, I would draw this for Arjun, and then during Arjun's um, villain phase, both gargoyles would activate, because all monsters of the same name activate. So, yeah. Glad we got rid of the gargoyle. But, unfortunately, now we have another one to deal with. So, we'll put that here. And now we have an encounter, and if it's too terrible, we can uh, we can cancel it. And it's something does damn it. And we're probably gonna have to cancel this. And now, if we don't, Alyssa's dead, and we'll have to use this healing surge. But let's see, let's see. Attack each hero. After the attack, place each monster that is not on the same tile as a hero one closer to that hero, so that part wouldn't do anything. Um, let me think. I forgot to get the gargoyle out for Arjun, so that's going to actually, so that would actually bring that one up. So let me just read this again. So, Tagichiro, and then Hmm. I guess I'll go ahead and cancel this. I mean, it would be temp it, It's Since Alyssa's on her last leg already, I mean, it's not the case that, oh, I definitely have to cancel it because she's going to take one damage because she's going to die for sure. Um, it's just a matter of when. So that got canceled. So we use uh, five experience. So two and three makes five. So we use that experience and we make a monster discard pile. So that encounter never happens. However, the gargoyle 
does get a chance to go, and it's going to move up into Arjun's, uh, it's going to move to Arjun's tile and attack each mo uh, hero on that tile, but that's just going to be Arjun. So bone pile to bone pile, and now it's going to attack with the plus eight, so we do need a low roll here. And five and eight is 13, so that's going to miss, but... Uh, a miss, you take one damage. So Arjun takes one. Okay, and that is going to be the end of Arjun's uh, turn, and now we're going to start Alyssa's turn. So, what is Alyssa going to do? So she can move up next to the rats, tap them for one, take them out, and then continue on to explore. That's probably the best thing for her to do. Um, yeah, <clears throat> I'm not even going to really make any debate about that. She's just going to move uh, here. It's good enough. And then she's just going to ping the rats. They go down. So we get that experience, which is nice because now we have five experience, which means we can cancel another encounter. Okay, so Alyssa, no healing yet, but she probably need it next turn. She moved, attacked, she gets uh, treasure for that. Any of these things worth using? Place the glyph of warding on your tile. The first monster that makes it, that moves to that tile, takes one damage. Maybe we'll throw that down, but the thing is you have to do that instead of attacking. And she's already attacked, so... Treasure chest, we'll probably let this play out, because these you at least have a chance of not doing, taking any damage. Um, that's a pretty low chance. She's probably going to die if I let this play out. So if she rolls, yeah, I mean you can see, if she rolls 1 to 10, she takes 2 damage and dies. If she rolls 11 to 15, she takes 1 damage, draws a treasure, and dies. 16 to 20, she just draws a treasure. I just don't know that it's worth spending our entire experience to cancel that. I Honestly, I don't think it is. I'm going to play it. I mean, I understand she's probably going to die, but there is a chance. It's 11, so she takes a hit. So she takes one damage and draws a treasure card. So we'll get the treasure card, and she gets... Uh, Oh, this is interesting. I mean, yeah, well, well, so, okay, so she takes the damage. So here's, here's the way I'm going to play this. She gets this treasure card, which allows us to discard an environment. Luckily, we have an environment in play. So we'll cancel, or this goes into the discard pile. This goes into the discard pile. This goes into the discard pile. And Alyssa, for all her actions because she takes that one damage and she's down so now that raises an interesting question well I guess she she's dead so she can't explore so that I, I mean I guess that doesn't um, hang on let me think about this for one second she moved she attacked the rats, she pinged them, why did we, why did we take a encounter, why did, wait a minute, I'm trying to remember now why, what just happened, oh, she got this thing, why did she get this, though? Because, I'm th I'm, I guess I'm saying because she explored, but I don't recall what happened there. Well, that's either the end of her turn, or I messed up. I'm actually going to look back at the video, figure out what happened there, because I kind of got myself a little bit confused, because I didn't write down what was going on. And there's so much stuff that goes on in this game that I got myself confused. So I think what I think what happened was 
I ha I was going to have her explore, so I drew an event, but then I never, uh, I never actually laid the tile, but I can't actually remember, so I'm going to look back at the video, see what happened, and I'll, and I'll get it fixed between now and the start of the next turn.